As we begin another school year, I want to welcome you back to campus. This year promises to be one of transformation and continued progress. Mary Lynn and I are consistently humbled and gratified by the spirit of generosity and the depth of feelings that people across Kentucky have for this university. After all, it is their university, and we, as faculty, staff, and students, are keepers of a promise, the Kentucky promise. It's the idea that nearly 150 years ago, this university was founded to educate the state's sons and daughters, to research our most challenging problems, and to provide service in every corner of Kentucky to those most in need. Now, we are finding ways each day to renew our commitment to that promise. You will hear me speak often this year about three pillars of our most important mission, undergraduate education. First, we must and we will recruit. We aim to be the top choice of students in Kentucky and the entire region. I am looking forward to sharing with you in a few weeks preliminary numbers for our first year enrollment this fall. They demonstrate we are making significant progress towards our goal. Second, we must provide. No university in the state or region can provide the educational experience that UK does. No one else has the full range of liberal arts, professional health and science programs that UK does. And no one else has the challenging core curriculum that we offer all students, a curriculum that prepares students for lives of leadership, meaning, and purpose. Third, we must produce. Kentucky won't be successful in the 21st century unless it develops a knowledge-based economy. That won't happen without UK's leadership. We've made lots of progress as a state in educating and graduating more students. But others aren't standing still. We must grow smartly. We must educate and graduate more students. And we must prepare them to create 21st century jobs that will help our state reach its potential. Recruit, provide, produce. They are the cornerstones of the Kentucky Promise as we continue our ascent. In the last year, we honored a National Book Award winner at UK. We received the university's largest ever research grant. We implanted a mechanical heart. We began what could be a $500 million transformation of residence halls across our campus. We were named the number one hospital in Kentucky. And finally, we won four conference championships it marked one of the best years ever for UK athletics. I can't wait to discover along with each of you what we will do in the coming year, a year in which we will find new ways, new areas of discovery, teaching and service to honor and strengthen the Kentucky promise that guides us still. Welcome back and see blue.